What's up, pandas? Peter Von Panda here. Uh, I want to show you this uh, running belt from Go Vivo. So, what's a running belt, Peter? It's a belt you wear when you're running, and why do you need this? So, as you know, I am just a health nut. And uh, when you go jogging, you see a lot of people with these armbands that have a little pocket for your phone and uh, car keys. You know, you lock up your car, you got a little stuff you got to take, take with you. Um, you know, credit card if you. I don't know, run a really long distance or something. Uh, but you put these on your bicep, and for all sorts of reasons, these have um, these aren't that great. So one of the, the things that I don't like about it is if you have biceps as large as mine, you usually have to strap this thing either by your elbow or up by your shoulder uh, because it just won't go around my 36-inch python. So the um, so one of the things is it's just not that comfortable, and even if you have really thin arms like a girl you know they can kind of slide up and down and so you have to really cinch them up kind of like a uh, blood pressure cuff and they can kind of be uncomfortable and then on top of that when you're swinging your arms back and forth things get rattled around a lot here if you have your phone and your camera in the same pocket or your phone and your keys it can get really scratched up and you're just kind of moving a lot of stuff on an arm that can be noisy uh jiggly distracting for no good reason um the uh so these are these are great if you have them it's kind of what you need but you know i don't understand why people haven't come to the realization to use more belts so what's interesting is here i'm going to give you kind of the pan through like um a star destroyer through star wars but you've you've got these uh typical kind of backpacking uh belt buckle adjustable this whole thing is elastic um, so this stretches, which is absolutely fantastic it's so to, to prevent chafing and uh, marks. And you have these the zippered um, expandable belt roll, essentially, this pocket roll. Um, and you have two pockets separated by the Go Vivo logo. And uh, again, you know, kind of expandable. It's a little, uh, I'll show you how this works. It's it's a little deceiving because it looks like, oh man, there's you can't get anything in there. But it's, it's a really clever setup. And then another expandable stretchy. Uh, elastic with the uh, the uh, female end of the buckle here. Um, it is adjustable, so you can uh, get it around your your chub or your <clears throat> your abs like me. Um, but uh, um, the questions are why, Peter? Why would you do this? Well, first of all, your waist doesn't tend to move around or swing as much when you're running as your arm does. So you kind of get away from having extra mass being moved around too much. Uh, you can kind of cinch everything up on your body. You don't have it really obviously on your arm. Um, the uh, and, and then the beauty of this is kind of the extra luggage capacity. So you'd say, well, it doesn't seem very big, and I said I'd show it to you. So you've got this one side, and what it is is it's kind of a big tube. Um, it's sewn here in the middle, so everything that you're going to want is going to stay on either side. But then it's kind of folded over before it's attached to the elastic. So I have right here is my iPhone 6 Plus, a uh, 5 inch LCD screen. You can see it's this is a big phablet type of phone. And I'm going to try for the first time, see if it fits in here, see if I can actually go running with it. And uh, you can see what I'm having to do is kind of unroll um, the. Uh, the the one side of the pocket and the kind of the bottleneck here is actually the 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 sewn middle portion so get in there baby don't fail me now can i run with an iphone 6 plus can i do it hmm well the answer might be no uh well and the answer is you can you can this is not this is kind of what's what's actually not a problem is there's plenty of material it's um it's kind of the length of the iphone getting right up into these parts where where this the, the the sewing kind of pulls the edges back in and kind of creates a little bit of a bottleneck but um i can actually get my iphone 6 plus in there low believe it or not and uh it, it actually has extra room to spare i could actually put something else in there um but it wouldn't it couldn't be the length of the uh the iphone and then on the other side you still have this entirely this other pocket here so you can throw your car keys or whatever you might have in there or maybe a little hard candy if you like to sit on something while you're running no problem and so i'm actually really uh stoked that that fits 
Um, if you're using the iPhone 6 or uh, another iPhone of uh, earlier generation or an iPod, if uh, that's where you listen to your music when you're running, um, you'll have no problems. Phablets of um, any size larger, you know, like this, the Galaxy Note, I think will will have issues, but um, you can get your iPhone 6 Plus in there. So that was my big test for the day. Um, the other thing is you just you tie it around, and I have put this on, and I'm probably not sure right now, but everything buckles up nice and easy nice solid construction this um, is kind of like a little bit of a stretchy neoprene type of fabric it's actually pretty thick and uh, I'm not sure exactly what it's made out of but um, I have no pro I have no doubts that this is going to be nice and durable and actually even might be uh, a little wetter weather and water resistant so it has actually a little mesh uh, lining kind of so it um, I think it will breathe. I probably wouldn't run with it um, in a full downpour or maybe if you enjoy doing that. But um, So I can't promise you that, but uh, a great, cool, practical product. So uh, definitely, if you're using the armband, give the belt a shot. I think you're going to enjoy it. Peter Von Panda out.